hello Gemini welcome to my channel Gemini is the third astrological sign in the zodiac Gemini is, the, is an air sign and is ruled by the planet Mercury the symbol of Gemini is the twins Gemini's are very thoughtful contemplative people are able to consider both sides of the story Gemini's are able to work out just really be in deep thought to come up with solutions for problems Gemini's do please focus your intentions your energy on this deck of card here so that we can get the best messages for you this is the messages for the sign of Gemini the third astrological sign of the zodiac the twin balance Balance, water sign, water, cancerian, off balance, in love, uh, maybe over expressing, in love. Can someone over express in love? Yes, money is very significant in your reading tonight, so we'll see. Money and so it's earth sign and water sign seems prominent in your reading messages for Gemini please highest prominent messages for oh. Gemini The lovers, lovers card, twin flame energy, soulmate connection, two people that belong together that have heated passion and desire for one another. This could be in in a feeling body, knowing that you're destined to have a certain type of love. There's healing coming up, so we are experiencing the new moon, you know, in that phase. So I feel like. The star card is coming up here to represent healing, writing out your wishes and your desires, temperance, having balance, connecting with the outer world, being connected to nature, to water. There was there's a lot of water, I feel. Water energy, Cancerian, Scorpio, Pisces, finding balance in water and in earth. You may have a garden that you like to take care of. That's a way of being balanced, giving and taking. Taking care of your garden takes care of you too, mentally, physically, emotionally. The Empress feeling good, grounded, motherly. Um, the Empress is a high card of strength, of dignity, of connecting with the with nature just being in connection with nature so i really feel like in this time a lot of people are out in nature the emperor and the empress so the empress is like very fruitful you know? like fire sign fruitful productive taking action um being a truth teller being of light, one that is joyful, in, in alignment also. So I feel like all of these are, you see all of these powerful cards that came out? 
I feel like there's great power going there's something powerful going on in the universe right now that's called for healing stability connecting with earth coming out of confusion writing your wishes clearly being precise about what you want so you are receiving directions on how to really ask for what you want a scribier to write down your desires what you wish to become Gemini so I feel it's saying come out of thought because thought can be confusing. So you're, you're a thoughtful person. You may be wanting to travel, to explore more of life, to be outside in nature. Maybe you're feeling that because you're trapped inside in the quarantine. And so you're looking to manifest something different, being outside. Maybe you're around your partner too much. You probably are married to this person. <laughs> and you guys are spending so much time together. It's probably overwhelming just being with that person for, 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 for long periods of time. Getting to see who they are. Because maybe before both of you were out working daily. So I feel like there's a lot of healing transitions. There's a lot of love going on in this time. A lot of love. Let me take a look at the reading. Three of Hearts, Gemini. Let's get some clarifications here. <sighs> what's, what's most prominent in Gemini's energy? What are Gemini's thinking about financially in love also? What's going on, Gemini's? Thank you so much for being here. Oh, the Ace of Pentacles. 